What are you doing? I don't know. I don't see, know. People, see, people, it's, it's weird how, 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 uh, you know, how, how videos, like if you send, like, like I have one arm right here, it looks like I don't have a muscle. That's why people have been saying, you know, get some muscles, but I don't think I'm blocking in that area. What? Look at the gun show. <laughs> Such a nerd. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's because some people, they, they say, oh, A.B., you're working out. Ow, 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 ow. They're saying you're working out. You know, you need to put some guns on. And I, I got some guns, man. You know what I'm saying? I got a gun there and I got another one over here. Get off my gun. Get off my gun. You know, I got a gun right there. You ain't got to worry about me. You ain't got to worry about B. I got a gun right there. Got one for you, whoever wants one. <laughs> I got a gun. Anyway, as you can see, I'm not... I didn't even know she was recording. Damn, you know that's that's a pretty good size. Some pretty good sized guns. They're okay. I'm still working on them. But hi, hi. I'm maybe Quintanilla. This is my wife Ricky. I'm not Batman this week because my Batman mask somehow came up mysteriously. Just it disappeared. Wherever this, you put it. As you can see, I wasn't allowed to wear my hat, my mask, or anything. And see my fade, it's all it isn't even faded no more, man. You don't have a fade. I have a fade. Well, I have you like... don't a fade means that it fades. You don't have a solid line going kuk, shaved one length. That's not a fade. Fade is when it fades. You're probably asking yourselves how we what the heck? Leave my hair alone, man. Did you feel that? No, I didn't feel that. Did you <laughs> feel this? I want to congratulate your friends that just yes, got married. Yes, my friends Vanessa and Jason. Vanessa I've known for six years now, and Jason actually used to be my old boss when I worked at Sprint when I was like 19, 20. They just got married, so congratulations. Yeah, and, it, and it's that. awesome. It's awesome because Ricky was like, she played Cupid, like I guess Vanessa would call Vanessa, you. Because Vanessa actually used to work a couple doors down from the Sprint store I worked at, and she would always go into my store because she thought my, my boss was so cute, and she would always always call me and she would always like ask me like about him and we want to congratulate them and, and thanks for inviting us out and I, I had such a good time yesterday because miss always calling me out over here on everything and correcting me on everything you guys have seen it firsthand <laughs> but it works <laughs> yesterday she says this is very important to me and I said okay I will go to the wedding so we're driving and driving and driving and driving, like for a good 20 minutes, man, maybe 15, 20 minutes. We went all the way across town from Corpus. And homegirl here. I read the invitation She wrong. read the invitation wrong, man. And we live like not even four minutes away from the place. No, it's probably like about five, six. Yeah. About six minutes. Six minutes away. And but I was I cool. drove us like 15 but minutes But I was away. cool. I was okay. I was fine. I was calm. I that was his whole joke yeah, for the whole that, that was, was my... that I pulled the Navy. You know what to talk about? I want to talk about this, and I think it's very important. I just want to thank my wife uh, for being there for me, even when times are tough and difficult and I'm not the easiest person to be around, which, you know, is... You can imagine. I, yeah, you can only imagine. Anyway, but Ricky did something for me that nobody's ever done for me before. And um, it really touched my heart. It was a Valentine's. It was, it was a, val a Valentine's, it was a Valentine's gift Day gift. And what she did is she made this scrapbook. And inside of the scrapbook, she put, like, all kinds of just cool stuff like you know little pictures in there and stuff. My, <laughs> I want to talk about this <laughs> picture. My niece Lily she is she just turned six. She comes home from school one day and she's like Aunt Ricky she's like I drew a picture for you and I was like you did? I said like, let me see it and she has it like all folded up so she unfolds it and she shows it to me. She goes that's you and Abe. I said really? She goes yeah that's Abe because he has spiky hair. <laughs> I said, okay. I said, thank you. It, but going back to, to oh. this this book right here, he this, this book, book right here, for the wives that are out there, because the guys are obviously not going to do it, or maybe some guys will do it. I don't know. But for you wives out there, sometimes it's good to do something like that. Cause it reminds you of, of what's important. You know what I'm saying? And for me, this this thing sits up on our dresser. It's on our dresser. It's on, our it's dre on, the, corner it's on our, our dresser. the corner of our dresser. And I pass by it every day, and I look at the picture, and I know what's inside of there, and there's... 
so much history in there, you know, and you can just, I don't know if you've ever looked at a picture and it just, auto, or heard a song and it could automatically take you back, you know what I'm saying, to that special place in time. So these pictures are, are very, very nice. But if you got the pictures laying around, ladies out there, why don't you put them in a scrapbook? Categorize make, it too. You know, categorize it and stuff and, you know, make it real pretty. She put like little glitter and, you know, it, it just, the, so much love went into this book and... No, yeah. the first one I've ever made. So I gave it to him, and I was like, I'm sorry if it's not really good. I was like, I've never done this before. Yeah, I mean, it, it, it was, I mean, it really touched my heart. I mean, it, it, was, my Valentine's it was her Day Valentine's present, present you know, you. and, and it, it, it was, it was, it was really beautiful. And, and uh, for you couples out there, for the wives out there, you know, maybe they're not as good as you would like them to be in your relationship. Maybe sit down and make a scrap. Remind him. Scrap, yeah, yeah. Remind, remind your man. Him. Remind your man. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Put this you. This is why we love each other. You know, you put your. This is why we love each other. And and put the picture. The first day you met. The second date. Your favorite foods. You know, you eating your favorite foods. Just little things like that. And and trust me, the, it, it's just like some kind of switch mechanism in a guy's mind and and in his heart. Not saying things are bad with us. But it just always keeps things, you know, reminding you freshly and daily why you're with that person. You know what I'm saying? So, ladies, make a scrapbook. You know what I'm saying? Put some love into it. You know, I'm sure you can go to a, a Hobby Lobby and find a nice little, uh, you know, yeah, book. And, you know, and, and, and just, just put little things in there. You know what I'm saying? All this kind of thing. <laughs> you opened it, <laughs> you opened it <laughs> look up. <laughs> look, at that. look at this. Look at this. Can you see us there in the corner? That is sweaty. Look at that. <laughs> You know, look at us. As, can you see us as Cholo and Cholas in the corner there? That what? was Halloween. Yeah, so, you know. The, that was just this last Halloween. Yeah, Halloween so, you know, so little things like oh, that. Gosh. The little the little things do count. And, and fellas, it's important for you to, and, and I forget to do this. I'm, I'm guilty. Is remember to open your wife's door. You know what I'm saying? You know. You know, I, I need to. I forget, sweetheart. I love you, but I forget. And sometimes I, I have this bad habit to where... She likes to walk beside me, and sometimes I think I'm pulling her behind me. But why would you want to do that? Why a, would you want to pull me behind you? Because it's a Japanese thing. Oh, shut up. <laughs> no, but he does. Like, I'm walking right here, but then he starts, like, coming in close, and I'm, like, get, starting to get squished yeah. between the wall, and I'm, like, scoot over. But she, oh, I thought you were behind me. But why she do does you not. She behind? doesn't She no. doesn't do it like that. She pushes me, like, no, like it's MMA, like, what? No, and puts him, watch, say something. And it's kind of like nudge him, like, hey, scoot over. Yeah, but I'm a little guy. Doesn't matter. Yeah, look at me. I'm little. Actually, if I look, I'm right here. I look taller than you. You even, what, one of your fingers is your is all chwex now from, doesn't even work? Which finger doesn't work? It was my thumb. Yeah, where she was cutting. Like, this part of my thumb right here where the scissor, like, sat was numb for, like, Three weeks, three four weeks. But it uh, it was it was like a, to go over it. Like I barely was, did that, and like it yeah, tingled. I was it like, was, oh, but it was. It, it, my thumb. But it was a it was a ama it was an amazing head. experience for me and and for you ladies out there. If you want to surprise your man, make a scrapbook. Just take your time. Make your scrapbook when he's off at work or whatever, and just get the materials. You like from a Hobby Lobby or Walmart or whatever. Yeah, and you and just just make a photo album and remind homeboy. Not that we forget, but it's cool when you actually see it. Cause when I saw the pictures and stuff, it just took me back to the first time I ever saw Ricky. Yeah, shot, I have that picture in there the night she, we met. Oh, she shot me down. I remember that night like yesterday, man. I I got shot shot down, oh, shot down out of the it. out of the sky, man. But you know, it's all good. Like I said, if you if you want to right there, I'll check my makeup out. Oh my god. I had on bright pink flamingo eyeshadow. And you see my hair all crimped? Homeboy went after that. Yikes. Yeah, well, it was. It, I did it for a show. She did I was it, in a she show. She was in a modeling show. In the picture of my hair, I was in a point. I was like, I am not going in this place with my hair. Because my hair was huge. It was out like this big and crimped. And I had these big old on the top of my and head. And for, I was like, I ain't doing that. So I threw my well, big old crimps. I had a huge old ponytail about this big. And the, the cool thing about it is, the beautiful thing about it is, is I'm very blessed in the sense that I, I have a woman, one of our first dates we went to, she actually is a person that holds things very close to her heart. And she says, I want you to take me to the Trade Center. That was our second date. 
That was our second day. You brought up Trade Center, and I said, let's go get hamburgers. Yeah, it's just, and, and Trade Center, for people that don't live in Corpus or not in the surrounding areas that can go there, it's like a, a, it's a pulga. It's a flea market, and it's where you can get a tattoo, plan your quince, uh, buy CDs, buy cassettes, buy hamburgers, get elotes, you know what I'm drink saying? Drink a beer. Drink a beer while you walk around. Buy a pet. It, buy jewelry. You can buy a pet. It's a flea market. But Ricky wanted to eat burgers. She goes, Cause there's a burger place in the back. I, I don't know. I don't remember what it's called, but they, because they're like the greasy, like the homemade hamburgers. Yeah, like they're the greasy, really homemade. The greasy buns. Oh, yeah. Oh, so good. Yeah, so that's where she wanted to go. He made a joke about taking me to the flea market. I was like, shoot all the dude. I'll go as long as you buy me a hamburger. Yeah, so we went there. That was our second date was a flea market. And then <laughs> we started finding not. out. Yeah, we started finding out we like the same place. go back there. So yeah, and, and, and we started finding out, like, I mean, little things like we went to McAllen. We went to a taco place where you get four tacos, a baked potato, some frijoles a la chara, and you get a drink off of four ninety nine. No, it's five... 95 okay so in, and then you add the dollar well for even the it, okay cheese and avocado. even if it's six or seven bucks that's still a great deal that's four tacos a baked potato some beans yeah, and a drink yeah. that's a good that's a good deal man if you're ever in McAllen, it's called taqueria de, jalisco. taqueria de jalisco and they've got like the little cantiflas on the front so that's where you know it, you're at the right place it's a little off the beaten path but it's it's a really good place but there was another we yeah, there's another one in Harlingen also. They're, they've had they have several. They have one in Westlaco also. So you know what I'm saying. So this, that the one we went to then? yeah, there's a lot. Of, there's a lot of places. I love you. <laughs> I love you too. Anyway, this is the end of a scrapbook. I'm not Batman. I'm Hand Man today. <laughs> Face palm. <laughs> I'm face palm man or whatever. We're going to let you guys go and we're going to sign off. We're going to be a little bit busy for the next couple of weeks. So we don't know when we're going to make another video, but glad you enjoyed the last ones and glad you enjoyed the Batman one. I'm glad you, you're enjoying all the videos and uh, we'll continue to make them, you know, and so share our lives with you guys. And I want to thank everybody that's come to the page and like my page. It's incredible how the numbers climb every day and and I, i'm just grateful to have you guys as my friends because I, I really don't believe in in uh in fans because because you hear artists say my fans no they're also fans of other artists also you know so you guys are my friends friends and family so you know thank you for being part of our lives and we love you guys and we'll talk to you real soon and don't forget ladies make that scrapbook man for you couples out there to keep your love Fire going high instead of putting gasoline on it. You wanted to cry when you saw her. I did want to cry. It was it was, because it was beautiful. It will get your guy. It will make him bring a tear to his. I not cry, man. I ain't crying, man. I just got some air in my eye, man. You know what I'm saying? But no, it'll touch his heart, man. Uh, scrapbooks are are amazing. So make sure you make one. Okay. Bye.